Hello, I'm a vocable object for. Let's finish this. Right? Yeah, that's right. Let us go and finish this up. A letter. Oh, I can read this well, the glasses. It's plain English. To my dear Miss Grundler, I presume you are well? Well, we have passed each other many times, many a time. Unfortunately, it would appear we have been unable to understand each other. I have prepared a special sleeping stand for you, and surely with this sand, even you will be able to slumber. I shall be waiting at the top of the castle. I hope you will not run away. The stairs are very old and full of holes, so please take care not to hurt yourself. Sam. Sam. Got the Sandman's letter. Uh, oh, it'll ask me to say it anyway. I'll be worried. Well, I didn't think you could actually follow him, Mom. Hmm. That's interesting. I didn't know that was, um, actually possible. Oh, I'm glad we're making the impossible possible. <laughs> Sandman. It was hard not being able to sleep right. I understand. I've been suffering the same way. Really, I'd want to be put to sleep too. I've wondered how good it would be to forget all the bad things and sleep. But, I don't want to sleep forever. I want to wake up, even if it might be a bad day. I'm sorry I can't understand, Sandman, but this is the only thing I can do. Here it goes. Ah. I just need that one head start. Oh, I got a head start. Okay, so first we gotta do the bad end. I deliberately do that? Oh, I can. Huh. Sandman? Sophie. You killed Sandman? I killed him? I, I killed the Sandman? I killed a fairy! Why? Why did this happen? What should I have done? I'm so sorry. I'm sorry, Sandman. No, that's not it. It's Sandman's fault, because he put humans to sleep forever, because he was so selfish. So, I haven't done anything. I've done nothing wrong. It's always been like that. I do nothing wrong, but put up with so much. That's what irritates me. It makes me sleepless. Yes, it's all their fault. Will you go back to your world stuff? Lullaby? You'll grant my wishes, right? 
What do you want? Don't you know? Sing me a lullaby, like you sang in the human. <coughs> the Tooth Fairy's mad. You stopped up work, he says. Just ignore that washed up fairy. Do you want to see this view too? It's really quite beautiful. All those selfish fools sleeping with such idiotic faces. And they'll never wake up. For all eternity. Feels truly wonderful. Watching them makes my heart bow. Lullaby, the songs you sing when it put me to sleep. To take revenge, I have to do it myself. Yes, this is revenge. Revenge on those who took sleep from me. Why haven't you vanished, Lullaby? The Sandman's gone. I can't disappear until you sleep. I'll never sleep, and the night will never end. You granted my wishes, yes. I won't sleep any more. The dawn will never come. No one will get in my way. I'll live forever in this world of night. In place of that imbecile Sandman, whose love of humans killed him. Bad in one, point of the night. All right. <laughs> uh, okay, that's enough of the bad endings. Let's do this properly. Sleeping Sane. Good night, Sam. You don't have to put up with it anymore. Take a nice rest. Sophie. You put Sam in to sleep. I couldn't kill him. He put up with so much for humans. He just wanted to sleep. How long will he sleep? Who knows? He's up for centuries straight. Maybe he'll sleep for centuries too. I see. What is it, Sophie? Maybe it was all that effort. But I feel really sleepy now. Sophie! It's no good. I'm just too sleepy. If I fall asleep now, if I can't wake everyone up, 
Will all the humans die? No, they won't die. Time has stopped for them. They'll just keep sleeping. That's good. If I, if I can wake up, I won't just put up with the bad things. I'll get back at Regan, and I'll tell Anne a thing or two, and Papa, I'll apologize to him. And also, I'll try to be friends with David. I'm sad I never even told him, but now we can be friends. I just want to have fun with him. I wonder if David thinks of me as his friend. Of course, you should know how, of course, you should know how nice he is. There's so much I've wanted to do. I want to think about tomorrow, but I'm too sleepy to stay up. Ah. Quiet, you. Not another word. There's nothing to worry about. You don't have to fear any monsters in the closet. I'll be right there. Did you say your prayers before bed? But I haven't heard you say it yet. Sophie, say it for me. Okay. Good night, Mama. His eyes are white. Though, <laughs> uh. so, the bat's gotta be killing him. Ah, uh, well deserved rest. Am I back? Was it all a dream? you staying at work? Morning, Sophie. I was working, but I fell asleep. I just got back. Hmm. Wait. 
big circle. Is there something you want to tell me? What? What was that call from the school about? I've never gotten a call from Sister Mary before. When the world happened, well, everyone fell asleep. You didn't do something bad, did you? I don't know. What do you mean you don't know? Listen, Sophie. I... I said I don't know. I didn't do anything wrong. Why did you get called? Just think about it. It's not like you would know. Or, but it's not like you would know. That's right, you wouldn't know, because you never pay attention to me. Just work, 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 never spending time with me. When was the last time we ate together? When did you last say good night or good morning? You've never done that for me. I'm not a good kid, because my selfishness made you, made you push yourself again. Sophie. <laughs> oh no, that's not good. Sophie, your hair's all red. Did you hit your head? Are you bleeding? Actually, plenty of people have red hair, and it's nice. All right, that's just a regular color. Silly me. Is your house built on a cliff or what, Ray? Huh? Just look at that hair. It's like you got a tornado in the tornado one. But if you live on a windy cliff, that might explain a few things. Like what a blowhard you are. <laughs> <coughs> what are you girls laughing at? Hey, what's gotten into you? What's gotten into you? I'm the only one you can ever show off in front of. You've always been Regan the blubbering crybaby. You? Wah! Hey, stop it, you two. What's all this about? But my word, what happened here? Miss Grundler, Miss... Blumberg, <laughs> I'm sorry. You're coming to my room this instant. You first, Miss Brundler. I quit being your Sam. If you make fun of me, I'll pay it back a hundredfold. And nobody's making fun of my mom's red hair. I decide I'll fix my own problems. I'll do what I can do about the things I don't like. How about you do the same thing? If you swear to never bully me again, I'll I'd gladly talk it out with you, like old times. Sophie. Why? Why did you do that? that? That's so mean to Reagan. Does it matter to you, Anne? I'm the one being teased. I, I do care, Sophie. Then why do you only ever watch? You said you were worried, but you just stayed quiet. You were just glad it meant that you wouldn't be a target, weren't you? No, no, I wanted to help, but... Liar. Just tell the truth. Say you were too scared. Sophie. I'm sorry. I was the one who told you that. That I was fine, so you shouldn't worry. I really did want someone to help, but... I put up with it so you wouldn't worry. I thought you might not be my friend. So I was alive. 
But I'm not doing that anymore. I won't let Regan get the better of me. I'll send her insults back and answer if she pits a fight. You might not like that, but if it's okay with you, I'd like us to stay friends. I'm disappointed, you, Miss Grumbler. A scuffle in the middle of the classroom? As a young lady, you should be ashamed. While I don't know what happened myself, such violent behavior is unbefitting of you. It's like what a little kid would do. Matt, what are you doing? <laughs> do you remember the passage from Job at my sermon? Enduring suffering heightens our merit. Hardship is no reason to use force. I'm no saint. And what is that? I can just grin and bear it, but does that mean I'll be repaid? Greater merit? Am I really supposed to just put up with all my hardship for that? Not even. Forget putting up with bad things to be called a saint. I don't want to be a saint. I just want to be human. It's far more important to be able to sleep at night. To do everything I can day by day, and to sleep looking forward to tomorrow. Are you talking back to me, Miss Grundler? Do you think it right to childishly, childishly do as you please? Do you think God will approve? And why can't you be a child? What is it? The kingdom of heaven belongs to those such as these? Do not raise such quibbles with me. What I'm saying is that your attitude is the attitude of a teenager. I don't mind if God doesn't care for me. Because ever since I was little, I know I've had someone watching over me. I will be telling your father about this. He may be busy with work, but this I cannot overlook. I'm going to have a long talk with him. Have fun with that. Do what you will, sister. Like you won't be available today. I have important business with him. Miss Grundler. <coughs> Getting out all the fields. All the Press the motion. Papa, did you not go to work? I took the day off. I see. Sophie. I, I'm sorry um, for not realizing how you felt. I, I thought you hated me. You're in high school now, and I wanted to be closed, but I thought you'd be annoyed. I'm busy at work, too, but I convinced myself if I just kept working, you could be happy. But I guess I was misguided. <laughs> I didn't know how lonely you felt. I'm truly sorry, Sophie. Can you forgive your papa? I'll, I'll be praying for the day I can. Sophie. I'm sorry for the awful things I did. I love you, Papa. I was scared to sleep in an empty house. I worried over things that were hiding in the closet, like I was a little kid. I don't want to be alone. Papa, stay with me. Of course, Sophie. You're my precious daughter. Today is the end of a long, cold war between us. How about we go out for something to eat, Sophie? Sorry, Papa. Hold that thought. There's 
somewhere else I want to go. Ow, jeez. What did you do? I fell asleep watching TV at your place, so my dick really sore. Yeah, that's why. Oh, yeah, that is what happened. Even saw you there. No wonder your neck looked. <laughs> uh, preference, sweet preference. Uh, David! Hey, Sophie. Long time no see. Alright, I should introduce you. This is Shirley, my fiance. Nice to meet you, Sophie. I've heard about you from David. Hi, Shirley. Nice to meet you, too. Oh, you seem pretty happy. Something good happened? Yeah, I told off all the horrible things that <laughs> were happening in my life. Well, there's a lot of what I talked about. A lot happened, and a lot changed. With Anne, Reagan, Papa. And also, the Sandman. Sandman? Feels like I've heard that. What was it? Yeah, that's hilarious. Before uh, Rise of the Guardians and this game, I had never heard of the Sandman. Ever. I had never heard of him. He's a fairy, David. A sleeping fairy. He uses his sand to put people to sleep. Well, that sounds like lots of fun, Sophie. We're going out to dinner, so do you want to come? You can tell me all about it. Yeah, that sounds great. Sure, let's go. Yay. So ends the tale of the sand. Made up? Of course it is. You remember it, don't you? Though you were asleep, you remember a night that felt like eternity. That night was the night you slept while the Sandman stopped time. Now close your little eyes. I'll tell you another story tomorrow. Good night, my little dear. Happy End 1. Don't stay up too late. Happy End 1? Happy End 1? What are you talking about? <laughs> Oh, is it that whole second playthrough garbage or something? Oh, I hope not. I need a blue window. Oh, uh, golly. Oh man, this game's been a lot of fun. <laughs> Golly, I didn't remember a lot of things from this game. I really didn't. Um, <laughs> as you can see from my puzzle solving skills. But if I had to guess, it says Happy End 1 because there's most likely secret and hmm. thank you Uri uh, I'm sure they'll, they'll tell me how they do the other good end I imagine at least that's what I imagine oh I'm a fireball
Congratulations on beating the Sandman, and thank you for playing. To those who also played the Crooked Man, you have my additional thanks. Thank you. This game differed in every way from its predecessor. Apologize to those who were expecting a TCM light story. But I've been planning this since starting the last game. I'm very glad to have finished it. Oh, Something Man series currently has four games in it. The story and mood differ depending on the man, so I hope people will try the other entries. Again, congratulations and thank you for playing. What do I do now? What do I do now? Wait, I'm gonna want to save. Um, yeah. This bed leads to a bonus scenario where you can see the story from a different perspective. Beat it and get some... Ooh, extra such as character bios. Ooh, I would love to do that. Should take about an hour to go through. Recommended for those who want to go all the plot. Uh... Uh... We'll get to the bonus scenario, but we're not going to play it. Uh, likely we'll play it in one go. But yeah, I'm totally going to do that. I totally want that. If I can get it from a different perspective. Sandman, Sandman. Oh shoot, I have to wait till I get to a save point. <laughs> oh, do I get to play as the Sandman? That'd be so much fun. Oh, whoa, whoa. No time for nodding off. Work, work. Oh, golly. Oh, dear me. Lots of people laying to sleep. Sand time, sand time. Oh, ah. Man. Take the sands of, sets of sand from the table and sprinkle the sand via holes. Put the bags under the flashing points on the map. Send them to the human world. Wait. Can I... Can you... Can... Why? Please. <laughs> Please. Save. We're lovely and we're we're lovely. Please save. So we're ending this video with that lovely blaring music, which I wish we just <laughs> saved in the other room and ended it there. But whatever. We got one of the happy ends. We get to play as the Sandman. It'll be a lot of fun. And I'll see you guys in the next video, which means tomorrow will be the last video of the Sandman. Because I'm going to play this bonus area in one go. I'm not going to split it up into parts. So, it's going to be a long video, but I want to get it done. So, yeah. See you guys in the next video. Bye.